Good morning, everybody. How you doing? This is Clarence T. Brown with the Talking About Limited Liability Corporation coming to you live on day 30 of my Volvo shift, making my vacation my vocation. I got to tell you something. You had to get up pretty early in the morning to feel as good as I do. I mean, pretty early in the morning to feel as good as I do. You had to hop up out of the bed, do some, some exercise, get your spirit together, get your body together, get your mind together. To feel as good as I do, because that's exactly what I did. I got up this morning, did my devotions, went downstairs, did my workout, lift some weights, trying to get physically fit, did some mental stuff to get myself together for my Bible ship, and I feel awesome. On my way into my vocation right now with a renewed attitude, my attitude just kind of been fluctuating here as of late, but I told you the other day the reason why my attitude fluctuates is because... I'm making my vacation my vocation, and it's getting harder and harder to align myself with where I've been. It's all about where I'm going. And so I'm challenging you today to get like me, to get like me. I want to I wanna let you know, when you start making your vacation your vocation, I mean, it's full speed ahead. You can't look back. You can't think about any other thing. You can't think about, okay, what I could have been doing or should have been doing or anything else. It's all about purpose and passion. That's what it's all about. It's about moving toward that thing that you were created to do because that's where you find your power. That's where you find all your resources. That's where you find all your help. Everything that you need to fulfill your purpose with passion has been built into you, guaranteed. I'm telling you I know so. And so I'm still challenging you to try out the Volvo ship. For me, it was a 30-day 30 30 day challenge to uh, make my vacation my vocation. Today, today is day 30. Now, the, the, the jury's still out on whether tomorrow I'll be sitting here in front of you full time or I'll be back on my vocation. But I will tell you one thing. My mentality has definitely shifted. I have made my vacation my vocation. When I get up in the morning, what I want to do is my vacation. See, if you think about what how this thing began, this thing really began when I had to be at work at 5 o'clock in the morning for a 7.30 shift. 5 o'clock to do a report for a 7.30 shift. And it made me start thinking, how much time am I actually putting into doing what I really want to do? As opposed to putting into doing what I really have to do. And so I started on a 30-day challenge to make my vacation my vocation because I realized it was something that I was kind of putting a half-hearted effort into. And so I made a concerted effort to put all of my focused energy outside of my vocation on my vacation so that my mentality would shift. So when I hop up in the morning, I don't hop up dreading getting ready to go into a vocation anymore. I hop up happy and excited about getting in front of my computer and doing some work. I, I hop up and, and excited about being able to create these things prior to even going to my vocation. While I'm driving in in traffic, and we talked about this, driving in through traffic, the one thing that I have now in my mind is, man, I got an hour to strategize on how I'll make my vacation better. When I come home in the evening, I have an hour to strategize on how to make my vacation better. And guess what? Instead of laying around watching TV all night long, your reality shows, no, cut the reality shows. Reality is right here. I have an opportunity to make my vacation better. So what I'm saying to you right now is you must, you must, you must pursue your purpose with passion. Okay? Do what you can to make your vacation your vocation. Hey, my day is still yet to be spent. Spun. Spent. Spun. My day is yet to be worked on. But how? Let's see what it's like at the end of the day. Because I am guaranteed to make my vacation my vocation. This is Clarence T. Brown with the Talking About Limited Liability Corporation. Coming to you live on day 30 a.m. session of my Volvo ship, making my vacation my vocation. You can reach out to me on the web at www.talkingabout.com. Give me a call, 703-563-9161. And as always, are you pursuing your purpose with passion? I certainly hope so, because I am. Hey, have a great day. I'll talk to you this evening as I continue my Volvo ship.